Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Chantel. This is my basic journey. I just recently got a 2004 Chevy Express with a high top. I'm very excited. I'm going to be building it out into the perfect mini camper for me and my dog Joey. So we have a lot of projects to do and this week we're going to be tackling one. It's one of the smaller ones. Um, Dave, if you guys have watched my previous video with him in it, is going to be helping me with a lot of the build stuff. Uh, he did explain this project to me and it sounds like something I probably could have done myself, but he's offering to help. So I'm going to take his offer and we're going to work on this rust maintenance this week. So in the video where I showed you guys my new van, I showed like the rusty part that's on the body on the outside. I'm just happy that it's not like on the frame of the vehicle. It's not on any of the parts that are underneath the vehicle. So it is really just a cosmetic issue. So we're going to be going through and we're going to be filling in those gaps and I'm going to spray paint it black. It's going to be a whole lot of fun. So I'm bringing you guys with me. And the first step is we're going to make our first Home Depot trip today. I'm excited. It's raining, so I don't know if we're going to be able to get to the actual foaming part because you really need it to be dry. Um, I'm going to talk to Dave because he was going to be coming over here, but we might just make it so I go over there, either if it's not today, maybe tomorrow. But we have to go to Home Depot and get all the stuff for it first, so let's go. I love you, Joey. I'll be back, okay? I'll be back. You gotta stay here, bud. I love you. Say hi to everybody. Everyone misses you. I'll be back. All of my mom's flowers are blooming. So pretty. Look at all this gray weather. Gross. looking for great stuff and black spray paint. Alright you guys, we are off. We're in the new van. We're going to go get some of this rust maintenance done. I'm very excited to get a project done on the van because I feel like it's been a while since I've been able to set up time with Dave to get things done. So, I'm excited. And hopefully I brought my solar panels with. Maybe we can like do a little Tetris trial on the roof to see if they're all going to fit with my fan. Just hoping we can get some stuff done. Ooh, I'm so excited. Are you excited? We're gonna go see Dave. I bet Coda's gonna be there. You guys get along sometimes. That seat's so much bigger than your other one, huh? Yeah, cutie pie. I love you so much. So I'm at my mom's camper here. She's at a sportsman's club, so you'll probably hear some gunshots going out in the background because they have a shooting range here. But she is a permanent residence, pretty much, here at this campground. It's like a sportsman's club that she's a part of, so this is her camper. We'll be sleeping in this guy today. Hi, Coda Bear! <laughs> Hi! Oh my goodness, you're so cute! You're so cute! You're so cute! <laughs> Is your friend Coda here, Joe? Oh, hey, Dave. <laughs> Alright, guys, so this is the rust situation that we're dealing with. So the first thing we're going to do is put some sealant on it. 
and then we're gonna fill it up with some great stuff sand it down and spray paint it with some rust stopping spray paint I'm happy that Dave knows what he's doing Big old garage. Okay, so we finished taking off all the rusty parts and scraping it down, and now we're gonna put some wax paper and some duct tape around that will hold in the foam that we're gonna spray in there so it won't bulge out before we spray paint it. 34 years. Not Coda. <laughs> So after we duct taped all the holes shut, we go through and we spray that great stuff in that I showed you guys I bought in the beginning of this video. And then it fills up the holes that are there. And then we can go through and we're gonna seal it and paint it black to match. Look at that happy face. The belly rubs. Oh, such a good boy. All right, that stuff has to sit for six hours and then we can spray paint it. Yeah. Alright, good morning you guys. It's pretty breezy, so if you can't hear me, I am sorry, but isn't that lake behind me super cute? I'm still at my mom's campground. We just checked the foam that's underneath the duct tape, and it was still a little wet, so we're going to let it dry, but we're leaving today. And so I'm going to come back in a couple days and uh, make more progress then. So, see you in a couple days. <laughs> Good job, Coda. Good job. <laughs> well, you guys, I got here and Dave is on a roll. He finished this side, got it nice and spray painted. We just got to put some sealing on there. Now we're working on mounting solar panels, mounting my fan up there. It's really coming together. So just a little rundown of what we have here. We have four 100 watt Renogy solar panels that we're gonna be trying to fit all four up there. Wish us luck. And then I have the Max air fan that we're putting up there. Obviously, I am not the person to be giving a tutorial or how to on how to put on some solar panels, but the first thing we had to do is drill some custom holes for our Z mounts, our Z brackets. 
um, to mount our solar panels on. And so we put them in custom spots to where it would sit the flattest on my roof. And then we're just gonna screw those on. Some bolts. Sorry guys, I'm not gonna be very helpful in how we put our solar panels on, but we're gonna get it done. I'm so excited. Honestly, I'm so lucky that Dave knows what he's doing because I have no idea. <laughs> and so he has been so helpful. Thank you so much, Dave, for all that you've done. Seriously. And he's gotten so much done already. I thought that, uh, you know, the solar panels would be all one video and the fan would be another video, but we're getting it all done at once. <laughs> this is awesome. So awesome. <laughs> All right, so I just went around the van with that cool power tool that you just saw and scraped off like excess foam that we have. And now I'm gonna go around and spray paint it all black just so it looks nicer. And then I, all we have to do is go over it with this like sealant and then we're done with that. And uh, we were gonna do the solar panel installation, um, but we need a couple more tools for that. So it's gonna be done another day. And so I'm gonna end this vlog here, but I hope you guys had fun. And look at how nice this turned out. It looks so much better than all the rest, right? So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new here, please subscribe below. I'll also put a link for my Patreon in the description box in case you're interested in checking that out and helping support my channel. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!